गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई विल डिस्कस अनदर बोन ऑफ द थोरासिक रीजन एंड व्हिच फॉर्म्स द लार्जर पार्ट ऑफ द थोरासिक केज एंड दैट बोन इज द रिब एंड यू ऑल नो रिब्स आर 12 पेयर्स 12 ऑन दिस साइड एंड 12 ऑन दिस साइड एंड हैविंग टू एंड्स वन स्टर्नल एंड एंड अनदर वन वर्टिबल एंड एंड फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट टू 12 रिब ऑल द रिब्स आर ओब्लिकली अलाइन इन एडल्ट्स and the intervening space between the adjacent ribs are called intercostal spaces and ribs are again uh, classified according to their adjustment or articulation with the vertebra as well as with the sternum how do we classify we we'll classify ribs in this way one group is called the true ribs one group called false ribs true ribs means when the ribs articulates posteriorly with the vertebra and anteriorly with the sternum called vertebro sternal articulation that ribs are called true ribs and among the false ribs some ribs all the ribs rather articulate with the vertebra from 1 to 12 but anteriorly some ribs they do not articulate directly with the sternum rather they will articulate with the costal cartilage like this all these ribs so they are called vertebro chondral vertebro chondral and some ribs that means the last two 11th and 12th these two ribs they articulate with the vertebra behind but free anteriorly because they are floating ribs they are not articulating with the costal cartilage and neither to the sternum so they are called the vertebral articulation so these two are 11 and 12 these two and these three 8 9 and 10 these three so 8 to 12 ribs are false ribs 8 to 12 this is 5 in number and true ribs from rib number 1 to rib number 7 so 7 ribs are true ribs they are also called vertebro sternal there the vertebro chondral this is vertebral so this is one classification of the ribs on the basis of the articulation and another classification on the basis of anatomical features and this classification will be like this ribs one is typical and another one is atypical and typical ribs means which are similar in their anatomical features like rib number 3 to rib number 9 these seven ribs are typical ribs and remaining five ribs like rib 1 rib 2 rib 10 rib 11 and rib number 12 these five ribs are atypical ribs because their anatomical features are different so the atypical ribs are rib number 1 rib number 2 then 10 11 and 12 and from examination point of view rib number 1 is most important so i will discuss the first rib 